Well, you can see the snow sheds in Wellington, right down in here. And this is where the little town of Wellington was. A lot of a lot of fog and clouds in here. It's kind of the first cool weather of the fall, so things are getting kind of foggy and misty. But anyway, the Iron Goat Trail goes on along kind of in this area here. We'll pick up another view or two of it in a minute. And right out in here, you can kind of see some more of the snow shed. That's that same snow shed that we were at the east end of it. It's still going along the mountainside here. You look right in here, in this area here, you can see the concrete wall of the original GN line. That wall was the back wall of a snow shed. And kind of past the trees here a little bit, you can kind of see over in the woods, uh, the track goes into the woods. This is the overpass on Highway 2 where it goes over the BNSF line. The west portal of the Cascade Tunnel is kind of right down in here. And if you go up the hillside from here, kind of, I don't know how well this is going to work, but right up in here is where the Windy Point Tunnel was. It's kind of right up in this area here. And uh, that's on the old lines to give you some idea of the elevation they got rid of by building the present day tunnel. And I say it's pretty foggy and misty out here right now too. So anyhow, it's kind of one of the beginnings of winter in the Cascade Mountains. But yeah, you can look down in here and see the overpass to the on the highway and then right on the upper right corner there where the white clouds are that's about where the windy point tunnel on the original line would be 